Hello, this week we'll be going over 3D matrices and how images are represented in MATLAB. A 3D matrix is basically a bunch of 2D matrices layered on top of each other. So we can only create a 3D matrix if we have 2D matrices that are the exact same size. Here's an example of how you create a 3D matrix in MATLAB. So first create the matrices a and B. Let's make a 2, 5, 3, and 4. And uh, we'll make B 6, 9, 8, and 7. Now we can layer A and B on top of each other using the concatenation function or cat in short. And the first input we have to put is the dimension that we're layering the matrices by, in this case, the third dimension. So we put three. And then we put the matrices in the order that we wish a, them to appear. So if you press Enter, you should get a 3D matrix C, where A is in the first layer and B is in the second layer. If we want to call out specific values from our 3D matrix, we can again use both indexing and the dimensions of the element. So, for example, if I want to call out to the value 5, I could either type C of 3, which is the indexing method, or I can type C of 1, 2, 1. Because in this case, we're looking at row 1 column 2, and the first layer of the 3D matrix. If we want to call out the entire face or layer of a 3D matrix, we can use the colon colon method. So type C colon colon 2, and we have called out a 2D matrix that's equivalent to matrix B.